Hi friends, welcome back to a surprise video. And I'm kind of thinking maybe I'll do three videos a week, a week now. Um, I usually have two, but I have so much jewelry, so we want to catch up at some point, right? Guess what we have today? We have a, a truly jewelry jar. I went to, um, went to visit my friend. She had a Goodwill store next to her. They had a jar. 60 bucks for this one um i picked it up there are a lot of cool stuff i see here what did i see here i wanted to look closer this one's interesting what else this one's interesting i think there is a ring somewhere i saw was interesting oh yeah right here this ring right here was interesting yeah let's take a look Let's take a look, but I have to, I have to stop buying jars and bags because otherwise we will never catch up with what I have. All right, let's open it up. And let's get going. So um, if you like anything in this video, please email me at yourvintagebeauties at gmail.com with a timestamp and a brief description. Uh, meanwhile, did you subscribe? If you like this type of content, don't don't um, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss content like this in the future. Oh, a lot of earrings! Ooh, there's a lot of stuff here. I don't don't want to lose it. I just dropped something. Okay. Oh, there are a lot of earrings. Oh, looks like silver. I think we'll be able to do the whole jar. This one's interesting. All right. All right, let's start with this quickly. Turn on the pressy because we will definitely need it. Okay. This is just craft item. Let's be quick. Single earrings. I'm not gonna look at them until we'll find uh, a pair. Found myself this magnet because I lost mine. All right, right here we have a pair of earrings. We have gun metal color plus some really dark rhinestones, red red rhinestones, very deep red rhinestones. They're not even glass. I don't even think they're glass, guys. They're a little bit. Um, actually, they might be because they're just a little bit. Yeah, they might be glass. A little bit kind of go into glass. Really pretty dark red color single single right here we have a pair of clip-ons no name faux pearls different color pearls okay this is a necklace we have real pearls, they're kind of iridescent pearls, and there is something on the tongue of the, right here we have 925, and right here we have a, a letter, looks like letter H. Huh, interesting, let me show you closer, the pearls, really pretty pearls, iridescent pearls. 
cool. Oh my gosh. This needs to be in its own. Oh, okay, so we have a layered necklace. Okay. Oh my goodness. There's my neck. A layered kind of necklace. We have a silver chain and at the very top and then we have kind of three layers, three strands in there. They are um, layered and there are pearls on them. Very pretty. We have to be quick because we have a lot. We have Christmas earrings, Christmas decorations, so yeah, very light. Another pair of clip-on earrings, gold tone, very light weight, probably plastic. This one's not plastic, but beads are plastic colored gold. They are, no, no name right here, clip-on earrings. We have another, okay, single earring, so I'm gonna just put it here. We have silver earring, looks like it right here. Yeah, looks like silver earring. I wonder if I have another one. Oh yeah, I do, I do, I do, I do. They're a little mingled, they're very soft, they need to be washed because there is tarnish that needs to be polished but i do think they're they are silver guys well let's test it yep yep i, I see the scratch becoming brown you guys can probably see it yourselves and right here we have very dark red. Okay, we have silver earrings right here. A pair of silver earrings. They're pretty cool. I like them. They're just a little mangled and needs cleaning. I got some acid on my uh, testing acid on my fingers. I'm gonna go wash it before my uh, skin is gonna turn yellow. All right, it's not painful. I don't feel it's a kind of um, oily substance and then the skin will turn yellow. Okay, so we have screw backs right here, gold tone, vintage earrings, screw backs. Let's see if we'll be able to take them apart. They have AB, AB rhinestones. Very pretty, uh oh, one AB rhinestones missing right here. We'll see if I can find it. If not, I can just replace it because I have it. Okay. Interesting. Let's take a look. We have very puffy, hollow, gold tone post earrings. Um, this was a not gold tone. So I would just think they are gold tone. I mean, they're, I don't see any stamps or anything. So we have really puffy half hoops, very lightweight gold tone. Oh, I think this one's silver. I think, maybe, let's see. I don't see any stamps though. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe right there. Yeah, there's something right there. It's hard to un hard to see what it says. What? It says foot. 
There's a lot of stuff that says right there. I can hardly see. Let's let's see if I can see through my loop. Oh my goodness, so tiny. It says 14 carats, I think. I think it says 14 carats right there. And then I don't see what else it says. But let's see if I have another one. Let's take a look. Do I have another one? Huh. I don't see it. Like just like that by looking I don't see. So let's put it over here. Another single one. Another single one. There's a bunch of single ones. This one's kind of cool. See, it, it has a little bit of a greenish kind of tint when I put this. So I think this is just like a check glass. Ah, oh, here's another one. This looks very vintage to me. And I think there says something in the back. I think it says sterling. Yeah, so we have sterling earrings with this. I think it's glass. Yep, we have glass. It's probably very old Czech glass and you can see it has a little bit of greenish kind of tint. When you put a per, a black light on it, Okay, so sterling earrings with check glass, vintage. Oh my goodness, yellow hoops, metallic yellow hoops. They're probably gonna go to craft. We have very pretty gold tone and purple enameled clip-on earrings. Uh, I'm gonna put them to craft, guys, okay? And this one's also I'm gonna put to craft. This pink hoops and this one, kind of a grayish pinkish half hoops also. Okay, let's take a look. Okay, these ones are pretty. So we have post earrings with this. I don't know what this is. It looks, I feel like resin. It, it doesn't feel to me like, oh my goodness. That's probably um, lucite, guys. This one's probably lucite because they are, see, they're glowing. So they're lucite earrings. Very pretty. There we go. Honey colored. We have a candy, we have one earring and one pendant, glass candy, and there is no more. So we have one earring and one pendant. So I'm going to put them to a craft if you guys want to make two pendants out of them or you can change this one to, the, to earring, you can do that. I can do that actually. I can uh, replace the, this one with uh, ear wire and make and make earrings. The glass, guys, the glass art glass. Okay, let's see. I want to find one of those because this one is most likely silver. I found another. This one's earrings, half tiny half hoops, lavender color, put it in um, craft. A um, couple more clip on earrings. Oh, uh, there is something on the back. It's one of those Sarah Coventry Monet or Trifari. That's George. No. Georgier or Ber Berger. 
yeah, Berger. Right here, Berger. Or I, I probably butchered it, I didn't pronounce it correctly. But anyway, they're very pretty. Very pretty gold tone and rhinestones stones clip-ons. Uh, right here we have clip-on earrings. We have gold tone clip-on earrings with faux pearls and a stone. And a stone is kind of like a glass. Yeah, the stone, this ones are glass cabochons. I don't think there is a name. Don't see any names. Here we go. Right here, I think we have glass um, earrings. Right here, we have glass earrings, uh, faceted beads, yellow, um, light yellow, and green. This might be silver, but I doubt it. What is this? Is this an earring or what is it? Is one or two? Looks like two. The dangle earrings, wooden beads and shells, silver tone, dangle earrings. We have chains and we also have like wooden beads and shells. They're kind of pretty. Oh, this one's might be silver. If we have another one, that would be fantastic because we have tourmaline or even more. Yeah, I think we have tourmaline right here or tanzanite. I don't know. Very pretty. But let's see if we have another one. Don't see it so far. Oh, yes, I do. Wow. We have a second one. We have its mate. There we go. Fantastic. Very pretty. Uh, unfortunately, I don't see stamp at all, but maybe let's take a look. Maybe right there. No. Oh, that's kind of that's kind of sad. Let's take a look on the post. Okay. I hope, I wonder, oh wow, my fingers, that's brown, it turned brown guys, I don't understand why there is no st stamp, but, but it's brown right there, there's silver, so we have silver earrings right here, some kind of tourmaline and marcasides, I think. Very pretty. Gorgeousness. This is very pretty silver tone clip-ons with clear rhinestones and rhinestones are with AB coated. We have ones missing right here. So I'm gonna put them, what is this? Oh, this is kind of gross. I will take it off later, guys. Oh, maybe no, maybe right now. That tells me how old they are, probably from like 80s. It's kind of cool. Wow, a lot of beads and bobs, huh? And this one's going to craft. And these are pretty. These are pretty. Earrings. Uh, 
So the big one right here are plastics. A small one right here are chips of um, amethyst. Sorry if it's a little darker. I tried to turn my light on. I turn all my lights and, and ring light and it's still, I think, dark. But I'm filming it in the evening. Because I wanted to come out on evening Saturday. Because I want to come out on Sunday. Alright. Oh, here's the second one. Here's the second one earring right here, kind of half hoop with kind of tur turquoise inlay. I think they're silver. Yeah, I think they're silver. I can test it. Uh, very pretty posts. Right here we have silver tone earrings and we have kind of like a twisted chain, silver tone and black. Is there something on the back? No. Oh my god, they're kind of yeah, dirty. Okay. What else do we have? We have silver tone and rhinestones dangle earrings they're post earrings very pretty kind of bluish greenish color rhinestones glass yeah they're i think they're glass i wonder if we have this one don't see it so far a single this one I'm gonna put to craft oh this one's pretty I think it has like um, turquoise dust inside inlay and this one might be um, no I thought it was silver but I don't think so but it has really pretty inlay inside inlay blue inlay chips oh. it's magnetic yeah I'll leave it for now and see if we have another one right here we have two a pair of glass faceted bead earrings Silver tone hoops, very clean. Um, oh, this ones are really pretty post earrings with flowers, gold tone with flowers. I think it's like a they're transfer maybe or no, they're stickers. I can see there's stickers. You know, I'm gonna put them to craft. This one's interesting earring, but I don't think I have another one. Yeah, I don't see. Oh no, I do. Oh wow. Hmm. Let's take a look what we have here. We have. I thought it was amethyst, but it doesn't get there. It stays kind of in the big in the middle of garnet. Maybe they're garnets. What do you guys think? Because they stay in garnet tourmaline. And right here we have. That's so bizarre. Over right, here we have uh, CZs, and the purple ones doesn't really go far. It goes onto garnet tourmaline iolite in the middle of there. But earrings are gorgeous. Um, I don't think I see anything in the back. I don't see any stamps or anything. I will definitely test them. Most likely for a silver because the posts are a silver tone. They probably were maize, but I don't see any stamps, so that makes me suspicious. 
This makes me suspicious. I'll test it, guys. But look at this. Look how gorgeous. All right, we have right here, we have very simple um, shell earrings. We have another pair of shell earrings right here. These ones are bigger, chunkier. What else? Yin and Yang. Craft. Oh, these ones are probably craft also, these post earrings. I am not a fan. What do we have here? Oh, Halloween is coming. Here's an... Oh, okay, guys. Hold on. Let me show you. At the very beginning, we found this wing without the ear wire. Right here is another. I'm putting them to craft. If you guys want them, let me know. Right here, we have a yes for Halloween. Let's see if we'll find no. So far, I don't see anything. Put them in single, single, single. This one, another craft. Oh, I found the birdies, Roadrunners. I found a pair of Roadrunners. They might be silver. I can test, but I don't see any stamps on them. And it looks like they have some type of chips, blue chips inside, like a mosaic or, yeah, very pretty. Okay, this one, my dog is barking. Okay, let's see. This one is craft. Okay, we found pair, a gunmetal color with black um, plastic, I think, beads. Yeah, they're plastic. Okay. Right here, a pair of earrings, silver tone with rhinestones. Looks like all the rhinestones are here. Let's double check. Yep, they're glass. These big ones, at least, are glass. Silver tone, cli uh, silver tone clip ons with the rhinestones. I see. Oh, these ones are going to craft because right here. One is broken, one is missing. I'm gonna put them to craft. Right here we have, looks like hematite earrings, gold tone and hematite uh, cubes. We have bronzy color dangle earrings, dangle butterfly earrings. Very pretty, kind of cute, very lightweight. Another pair of earrings, gunmetal color, discs, dangle earrings. Okay, I found this one. Another dangle uh, silver tone earrings with um, green and clear rhinestones. Or I think they're plastic, guys. Some of them, this one might be glass. Here, earrings. A pair of gunmetal color and kind of pinkish purplish uh, seed beads and rhinestones. Let me see if I have another one. I don't see it. Putting it right here. So I found second this earring, but this one's missing ear wire. I have pretty uh, plenty of ear wire, so I can add it. This one has some weight to it. This one's a natural stones. They might be just colored highlights. And right here we have like very pretty kind of beads. What else? Silver tone. Silver tone chain with a dolphin and the bead, blue bead, blue cat's eye bead. And 
another pair of earrings, silver tone and plastic beads. Right here we have glass earrings. How did it get there? Right here. Silver tone and art glass. Very oh. dainty, very pretty. Another pair of earrings. This is kind of very muted gold tone. And right here we have agate. Looks like we have jedites or agates. Very gorgeous. All right, let me take this ones out because everything is, what is this? This is very artisan piece. We have pair of earrings, they're bronzy color with black. It might be jet. Goes to tourmaline line, maybe onyx, but I think these ones are jet. Oh, let me take a look. I already have white. If it leaves black streak, it's jet. No, it's not jet, so it is probably onyx. It's very artisan. Pair of, is it Snoopy earrings? They might be gold plated. Yeah, they might be gold plated. They're kind of close and a kind of style. Let's see what it says on the back. It says Aviva. Okay, I'm not gonna read upside down. Aviva Taiwan United feature. Okay. All right. Here, closer. Very, very cute. Oh, 1976. Very vintage. What else? Oh, I found it now. Look at this from um, what that game? Oh my god, Ouija board! Ouija board. We have yes and a no. Cool. Um, this one's kind of seed bead. I'm gonna put them to craft. I thought it was a second one, but I think it's different. Here it is. This one's the second one. If you like purple, if you like purple and silver tone, right here you have very pretty kind of like chandelier dangle earrings. These ones are pretty also bronzy color with faux leather, but um, these ones are unique. What do you think? Oh, oh my god, this stock. I don't see anything on the back. Very unique earrings. I don't see another this of this. We put it here. This one's here. This one's glass, but uh, it's only single one. This one's also single. This one single would be pretty. Single. Oh, this one's kind of yucky. It's all rubbed off. I'm going to put it in uh, craft. Oh, here's another one. Second, but I'm I'm going to put it in craft. Very lightweight. I don't like it. Uh, right here we have a single earring. Blue uh, kind of teardrop, but again... So far, only single. I don't 
see another one right here we have a cross i think it fell off of something yep i think this one so let's see it has one stone well it it came diamond but i only see one it's kind of a like false stones let me show you yeah see right here it's there's no stones no stones but it looks like ones no stones here but right here we have only one stone and it's uh, tested as a diamond but it's very dirty it, it is so dirty guys it's like yeah it, even though it says nine to five and this one is a single test diamond or or moissanite yep yeah go stretch I, I can show you guys if you want to see yeah but i don't think the quality is really good or maybe we need to clean it Oops, sorry let me show you right there go straight there so hmm, that's pretty cool pretty neat toe okay let's see what it says here on the chain It says something carrot. Oh, what? Does it say 18 carrot? Yeah, it says 18 carrot, but <laughs> I don't believe it. I think it's magnetic lock. I don't believe it. That's not 18 carrot. It's just they find that thing and they attach it. Yeah, it doesn't say anything on the closure at all. Like my uh, jeweler said, if it's 18 karat, it's gonna be it's gonna be stamped on every single separate piece. So it's magnetic. Yeah, it's magnetic. We can test it, but I'm telling you, it's not. But I'll put it on this one. If you want me to put, I actually maybe gonna find a silver chain for this cross, guys. Yes, yeah. Let me find a silver chain for this cross. I'm not gonna put this one on it. I'm gonna find silver for this one. We have a stretchy bracelet, silver, silver tone with rhinestones, very clean. Stretch is good. Different chains. Let's see if there's silver chains here. No. Oh, very no. Very no. Another very no. What else? Magnetic. And this one says Leah Sophia, but I don't have a pendant yet. Um, what else? A lot of non silver stuff. Very powerful magnet. Uh, right here we have a chain with this just hammered silver tone pendant uh, disc. It says PL right here. PL. Uh, what else? Another chain, non-silver. Yep, very non-silver. And right here we have a necklace. We have silver tone. No rhinestones. Oh, no rhinestones. <laughs> no tags. No anything. Right here, it made really pretty kind of metallic beads. They're tricolor silver, a gunmetal, and gold tone. All right, let's do next. Ne next grab. Whatever is, um, if it's silver or anything, a single one, I will, if you want to have it, let me know, but I'm probably going to put them into my scraps. Okay. Um, silver tone necklace with a greenish and bluish plastic acrylic cabochons. I usually put this ones to craft. We have silver tone chain with the puffy heart silver tone puffy heart pretty not very heavy 
bangle bracelet not silver you can see what this is also non silver hold on okay it's a silver tone locket my god this this magnet look how strong this magnet is oh my goodness so we have a locket silver tone locket let's see if anyone lives inside this purple rhinestone is glass I can open it where is my knife it's pretty clean no one's inside it's it's pretty it's like look at this um, I'm showing you with the knife it's um, kind of um, carved engraved whatever you call it very pretty cute and the chain is pretty substantial moving right along another silver tone chain with shimmery kind of greenish cabochons rhinestones are here uh, right here we have something on the cards is a gs jewel necklace jewels necklace silver tone very lightweight kind of plasticky i don't know craft seed beads and the brownish beige seed beads glass beads i think and shells yep this one's a glass we have shells and wooden beads and seed beads very pretty beachy very beachy necklace we have a silver tone necklace no stamps um, with turtle and right here we have another kind of a nautical theme we have sea star or starfish silver tone with the sand dollar and a faux pearl they kind of go together I think very nicely on the silver tone chains no tags this one's might be silver guys right here this one's might be let's see yeah this one's might be silver no no you're not silver let's see what these are i think they're just glass I can't even they're so slippery yeah it looks like they're just glass we probably need to test this ones because it might not be silver okay let's see you know what no it turns brownish i didn't scratch it very hard but it does tur turn brownish yeah it's silver guys it is silver necklace that is great right here we have silver kind of native necklace right here we have silver tone necklace I do not see any tags so we have this faceted beads green and they are glass and they come to a V then we have rhinestones and the tassel oh oh my okay 
let's see this is just a single chain this one's not magnetic but I don't see anything we need to find a chain for that cross that cross fell off of some kind of a silver maybe this one I think this one says 18k something a gold field maybe or gold plated I don't know F, probably gold field um, again I don't think so because it's only says on this thing on this one nowhere else and it shouldn't be like that and uh, closure is kind of gross and weird so I think it's just a silver tone it's not magnetic though just for just for SMGs right oh no this is very no this will not test positive for silver guys or anything else all right a bracelet uh, we have kind of a um, quartz right here and rhinestone rhinestone flowers some have a b centers a b quarter some just have clear magnetic did i say it's a bracelet yes it's a bracelet oh my god everything <laughs> everything goes towards that magnet okay we have a silver tone necklace here it's a bib style necklace uh, ornate uh, very ornate necklace right here one jump ring is missing right here I can add it that's kind of cute on the other side it has a little bit of wear and we see a little bit of a copper picking through but on this side it's very clean no wear very pretty very very pretty silver tone necklace it has two lobster claws so it might be a decoration for clothing uh, but it's pretty it's pretty it has some weight uh, silver tone and gold tone discs two strands they are layered right here it's very clean and very pretty we have a silver tone bracelet right here with um, yeah, just a silver tone bracelet. I think it has, not I think, it, it does have oh, pearls, white pearls and black pearls and gray pearls, purplish um, faux pearls. Right here we have one, or no, right here we have a few rhinestones I'm missing. This one goes to craft. Silver tone bracelet kind of weird I'm gonna put it to craft guys it's kind of yeah, yucky oh here it is look at this um, this is from one of the clip-on earrings remember that was missing one of the rhinestones if I can find it right now, I'll show you. It's under the mountain of jewelry. Well, it's in the beginning we found it. Yeah, I can't find it right now. Yeah, so, but I found it. I found it right here. Okay, silver tone necklace. We have lobster claw and it is Leah Sophia and a silver tone discs different sizes very clean okay let's take a look at this this looks to me like a uh, natural stones oh you know it's Labrador right guys if you can see right here yeah, those are Labradorites. Three beads, gold tone necklace. 
The closure looks like it could be gold, but I don't think so. It's gold tone. Yep, very gold tone. It's magnetic. I don't know if you've seen it. It's very magnetic. What these ones are, natural labradorites. Yep. Very pretty. You probably can see the shine. What else we have here? Let's take a look at this one, silver tone chain. We have some kind of plastic rose or polymer clay rose. And right here it says Z-A-D. Okay. And non-silver, we already see it. Necklace. Where do we have this one's probably yeah this one's premier design right here we have a single chain and then it comes down to a multi-chain necklace it's a bit layered we have different types of chains and faux pearls silver if silver beads and faux pearls okay premier design let's grab Oh, this is something I wanted to see. This one right here. Okay. Let's take a look. Right here we have a bracelet, gold tone with double checking, glass, glass glass yeah these are glass beads right here we have evil eye protection but it's missing a lobster claw i need to put it in right here we have dragonfly i need to find lobster and just attach it but it's a very pretty bracelet right here we have a stretchy glass bracelet with silver tone beads again two lobsters that's kind of interesting art art glass beads a silver tone ring. Oh, there is something saying it's here. Oh, Sarah Coventry. Sarah, Sarah Coventry gold tone gold tone ring with um, brown glass crystal. It's adjustable. No, not adjustable. No, no, not, not adjustable. It's probably nine. Let's take a look. It's not really circle for some reason. Well, now it's circle. Oh, it's yeah. It's probably like an eight because it wasn't really a circle. It's kind of like weird shape. It's like eight or nine. Very pretty flower right here. Very Sarah Coventry, you know. Very Sarah Coventry. Right here we have very cool oh, single earring, silver tone with green rhinestones. Putting it in our singles. Right here we have a very cool uh, necklace. We have barrel clasp, kind of old barrel clasp. We have natural, probably agates and kind of mixed in with um, tiger's eye somehow. And it's knotted in between. Yeah, it's very interesting. Look how it's kind of it's done. Look, we have tiger's eye right here, and right here we kind of have an agate. Okay, they're very uh, heavy, very beautiful color. Silver tone ball chain with Barbie pendant. Aspire to be Barbie. Oh, I'm not reading that. Okay. Right here is a Barbie. It looks a little bit like Jade, uh, what a K jewel. Okay. 
All right, this ring I wanted to take a look at. I don't know if there are any stamps on it. There might be right there, but I can't see. I don't see any stamps on this side. Nothing on this side, nothing on the bottom. Okay, nothing outside. All right, let's test it. This one's is jade, I would think. Let's take a look. Oh yeah, it goes straight to jade. Let's let's test it. Juicy line. Silver acid. Turns brown. I think, I think you guys see it, turns brown, where is my cotton round, red brick color, we have silver, beautiful ring, um, I think it's seven, this one, well, because this one's kind of has an opening and like some, yeah, if I put it on this one, it's probably going to be a six on the mandrel. It's probably going to be a six. Yep, it's six. But you can fit bigger because right here they have a lot of space for a finger to go to. <laughs> Very pretty silver ring with jade. What is this? Oh, these are amethyst. Oh, that's a weird I'm so confused so right here we have a flower we have this one's go to amethyst for sure in the middle what do we have in the middle I don't think I can I think it's very small crystal CZ in the middle we have CZ I think it's just gold tone I don't see any I don't see any stamps and it's kind of the coverage is not as smooth you know the it's not like very good worksmanship but it's pretty it's very pretty pendant gold tone with amethyst and uh, CZ if there is anything right here it's too tiny for me to see no there is nothing it's just a cut pendant cute right here we have a another necklace I don't know what this is it's not magnetic but I don't see any stamps it might be made artisanally yeah I don't see any stamps and this one's probably glass beads yep we have a green or bluish glass beads necklace let's see Oh, let's test it. Juicy scratch. Nope, this is not silver. First of all, the line disappeared. Second of all, whatever is left over, it turns blue. Yeah, right here. See the kind of grayish, bluish. It's not silver. But it's still very pretty. Very pretty necklace. This is hollow, lightweight. Very pretty. What's next? Right here we have silver tone necklace with silver tone beads. not magnetic but this is not silver oh no this is not silver it does have oh yeah I can see it right here it does have some kind of copper picking through all throughout um, but it's only where the beads were where the beads are going back and forth on the bottom right here um, everywhere else it's pretty okay it's, I'm probably gonna wash it very interesting pretty substantial in weight uh, silver tone necklace 
Uh, right here we have another silver tone item. This is a bracelet. Bracelet has very pretty uh, closure. Lobster claw with the heart. I don't. It, this is not uh, Brighton. It's just a uh, closure. It has a heart. It has a praying angel and a real pearl. Silver tone. Uh, gold tone necklace, lobster claw with this. I don't know what this is. Okay, I don't know. Okay, gold tone. Um, uh, you know, I am in software engineering, so but and I know this this to me right here. This looks like Fibonacci sequence. So, yeah. <laughs> All right. Right here we have another silver tone, I think, necklace with a pendant. Oh, it's not magnetic. Let's take a look what it says here. LA. CN, probably China. Right here we have hearts and rhinestones. I don't think I can touch the rhinestones. Oh, rhinestones looks like CZs. Very pretty pendant. Right here, rhinestones look like CZs. We have two hearts, bigger and smaller. Let's see if there is anything on the closure. There is something. LACN. Yeah, it just says LACN. I don't think it's silver. I think it might be plated, but. Yeah, I don't see anything. It's cute, though. Right here we have another bracelet, uh, another uh, premier design right here. Bronzy color, silver tonish bronzy color bracelet with different uh, premier design right here. We have a cross and uh, kind of engagement ring and a heart. Cute. Okay, what is this? This is very interesting necklace. We have silver tone circles. We have kind of a hammered leaves and rhinestones. We have um, silver tone lobster claw. And right here we have a tag. Let's see what it says on the tag. Equilibrium. I think it says equilibrium. Yeah, I don't even know. I've never heard of equilibrium. Let me show you closer. Very pretty different color, blue enameled right here. Hmm. I'm gonna have to take a look what equilibrium is. Okay, we have another silver tone necklace. This one is Charming Charlie. It has hammered discs and kind of a faux druzy or shimmery discs, silver tone. Okay, let's take a look at this. This one may be a Trifari. I don't know, it looks like um, a cross, a Celtic cross or whatever. Uh, what, right here we have glass. Of course it's glass, but it goes to a very, very high top glass. Maybe CZs, I don't know, but this ones are glass. I don't see any I don't see any stamps or anything. It's gorgeous. Look how pretty. Look how pretty this one is. Very pretty. Hopefully it's not too dark, guys. I'm I turned all the all the lights on. I don't see anything. 
Um, chain has a little bit of wear. It does have a wear. I don't see anything on the chain either. I'm going to have to Google a kind of a lens it. Next is just gold tone chain. And right here we have right here we have another bracelet silver tone uh, for strands for different strands of chains and we have uh, open crosses all throughout and faceted beads all right let's do last last pull and we're done we're so professionals now guys ow ow okay we're doing so quick okay let's see what do we have here silver tone necklace with a very pretty glass faceted glass beads they're kind of very dark blue very pretty blue i wish i could show you how pretty it is right here look how pretty this blue is multi-stranded layered next is oh wait a minute are these together because this one says honora or honora collection and this one has an h on it i think they're together i wonder if i have another oh yeah i do move aside okay we have two earrings with pearls let me see if they're even natural hard to say hard to say guys this one's i think this one's naturals but this ones are not no they're not together but on this one we have Anora collection, but I'm not sure it's on for this one. I honestly think this is for this one because there is an H on a back. I have this one's silver and it has H on the back of this right here. Remember when we saw so in the beginning right here it says 925, and right here there is let me show you closer but here we have H so I think this one is an aura collection I will definitely research and if it is I will uh, uh, add it to this one and right here we just have a silver tone and faux pearls earrings right here okay and I think this one is an aura collection I will research all right what's next necklace Char charming Charlie some plastic beads and some natural beads the big ones is natural this one's probably just glass and this one is just plastic yeah there are some plastic this one looks like um, how light and this one's uh, round ones are just glass or ceramic okay charming Charlie necklace silver tone bingle bracelet it's Monet right here we have a Monet kind of like a diamond cut right here Uh, right here we have a gunmetal collar necklace with a gray rhinestones. They're glass. Yep, glass rhinestones. Okay. Oh, look at this! Another, another ring. This one should be, should be silver. What does it say here? Says Max 925, very pretty, very pretty. I 
juicy scratch immediately turns brown or dark red here we go silver gorgeous silver ring this is pretty big guys this is pretty big this is probably like 10 or 11 i kind of like it i kind of like it you can do it on the on a thumb on this one on this one it's probably 11 maybe men's oh no it's nine and a half i maybe lost weight or some oh no it's because it's kind of open right here very pretty i'm gonna wash it and i'm gonna think about it all right right here we have earrings they're quite heavy they're dangle earrings for pierced ears with green rhinestones light green rhinestones uh, right here we have necklace oh it's one necklace i think oh yeah it's like this so we have a white house black market silver tone with beads uh, the beads are glass 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 they're glass glass black beads silver beads and then it comes to a v then we have rhinestones and a very long pendant uh, uh tie with, with tassel all right it's getting very dark outside hopefully not too dark for you guys right here we have a cord we have a cord fabric cord with two flowers not quite yeah two flowers the pink shell and clear shell this is mother of shells it's very very light this one heavier and how is it oh it's like this two pendants and there's something on the back let's take a look oh my god look at this is gold plated 18 karat gold plated and this one says 18 karat gold plated okay all right they're very pretty they're very pretty flowers right here we have a silver tone with rhinestones necklace seems like all the rhinestones are here one is dead though right here oh and it is very um vintage because it has a hook because it has a hook so we have right here we have a very pretty necklace right here we have a hook nothing says on the hook but we have a vintage necklace here here very cute here's the back and we're almost done uh, silver tone bracelet it says china right here says cookie lee silver tone with dangles dangle kind of like washers some are hammered some are plain bracelet we have a necklace right here we have a necklace seems like it's also vintage there is a little bit of um, vert, uh, verdigree i think right here i need to wash it gold tone um barrel clasp we have faux pearls golden beads and we have i think glass no not even glass no not glass it's all uh, faux pearls and plastic yeah what is this this is huge bib style necklace it is j crew i never thought j crew do necklaces like that i never need i never know let's take a look i can't even fit it in in the camera so you guys can see it's very yeah it's a statement this one is a statement I think these are glass. Uh, it kind of jerks a little bit, but not enough for me. Yeah, 
not enough for me. So we have J. Crew necklace here, bib style. A silver tone chain with a pendant, silver tone pendant, birds and rhinestones on their wings. Silver tone. We have a bracelet, silver tone. It says S J, I think. It says S J. Fold over clasp, silver tone, and right here we have like abalone, maybe, or maybe just um, yeah, I think it's abalone. Yep. Yeah. I think it's abalone flowers inlay. Nice bracelet. A seven, seven inches. Then we have a faux tortoiseshell bracelet. Seven and almost eight, seven and three quarters. Right here we have also bracelet, a very cute, it's um, kind of like toggle, silver tone, heart and arrow toggle uh, clasp. And we have it, someone probably made it, they're like seed beads and they're like weaving together. Very pretty uh, purpley color. All right, and the last one right here, we have a, oh, another White House Black Market, gold tone, multi stranded pretty heavy necklace kind of all the rolled different rolled chains layered a little bit right here all right we did it we did it we did it all right hope you enjoyed this um bonus video on sunday i will try maybe to do three videos uh, a week for a while because i really need in, in order for me to buy more i told myself i had to do what i have right now i am like on a on a diet, jewelry diet, okay? I'm not allowing myself to buy any more because I have like boxes and boxes and boxes. And I, and I just bought a, another box from Goodwill uh, Finds and I'll tell you why, I'll tell you why. And I'm probably gonna make a video how I choose a box because I promised a lot of people ask me to make that video and I'm probably gonna do that. And, um, and I will explain you why I bought that one. Okay, all right. I hope you like it. Thank you so much. Don't forget to subscribe and help me to promote my channel. I really enjoy uh, doing this for you guys and for myself. I really enjoy doing this, to be honest with you, really, really. All right. Thank you so much. Talk to you later. We'll see you later and very, very soon. Bye.